Hi Crafty Patty back with another great baby idea for your showers, for your grandchild, and it's the bandana bib. They're great because there's not so much material for the baby and they're absorbent and while they're feeding they're just an easy way to clean up. One small piece of fabric, polar fleece on the back, a piece of velcro, and you're ready to go with these darling little bandana bibs. Stay with me and I'm going to show you how we made these. Materials needed for your project will be material scissors, paper scissors, a pen, piece of velcro, your pins, a scrap piece of fabric that measures about 15 inches by 10 inches, and a scrap piece of polar fleece 15 inches by 10 inches. And the pattern I'm using today was from simplysmallwonders.com and this is her pattern for the bandana bib. Now she suggests that you place this pattern on a fold of the fabric, but I'm actually going to actually cut the other side to this so I can cut both my pieces of fabric out once. Taken my pattern and I've traced around, I've cut that out so just match up your edges and tape in place right side up. I'm then going to place my polar fleece, my pattern, on top of that. I will then pin in place. Once you have it pinned in place, then simply just cut out both pieces of fabric together. So once you've cut around, you can remove your pins Remove your pattern piece, place together, ready to go. So just place your pins back in again and you'll be ready to take it to the sewing machine. Start sewing on the straight edge of your fabric. I'm going to make approximately one quarter inch seam allowance and just sew around the whole bit. And leave about a two inch opening so you can turn the bit. Just check, make sure that you've caught all your edges of your material on the back side. It all looks good. Sometimes the polar fleece tends to slip a little bit, but we're good. So now you're going to find your opening and turn to the other side. So the right side is facing out. And if you want, you can always use a knitting needle to help you push this through. And once you've got most of it turned, I just come in with a big knitting needle and just make sure all our corners are turned nicely. So now I'm going to go and press this so it's nicely ironed so it makes it easier to then top stitch. I'm going to start stitching where my opening is where I've placed my pin. So I'm ensuring that this area is nicely sewn together. And now I can continue around the whole bib. I've now finished top stitching around the whole bib and now the last step is to add your velcro. So just place your velcro piece on top and sew around. And now that I've chosen to put my velcro on the top, obviously I'm going to put the other side on the back so it will join. And here we have our completed little bandana bib. We've got the nice soft material on the one side and the polar fleece on the other. Velcro has been added, ready to attach. And there we have our cute little bandana bib. Thanks for watching and I hope you'll have fun making lots of these adorable bandana bibs. And if you would like to have more ideas on more baby shower gifts that you can make, just click here. And if you'd like to subscribe to my channel for more Crafty Patty videos on a variety of arts and crafts, just click down here. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye bye for now, we'll see you next time.